day YouTube. This is just a bit of a quick and fun comparison video between Ubuntu 21.04 on the left and Kubuntu 21.04 on the right. So it's all in the name of uh, a RAM comparison video here just to see how much each of them does use on boot up. So nothing, nothing's loaded in the background except for the operating systems themselves. And they are actually quite different. So the back end is all the same Ubuntu, but the front end is a little bit different. So Ubuntu is actually running on the, uh, the the GNOME desktop environment, whereas Kubuntu is running on the, the Plasma desktop environment uh, instead, which is a bit, uh, uh, really gooey in nature there. It's meant to be quite pretty. I don't find it so, but that's for another video. Now, getting into it, let's have a look. Ubuntu. It uh, runs on 780 megabytes of RAM on boot up in this instance here. Uh, very little CPU, which is nice to see. No, nothing in the swap drive as well. And then on the right hand side, we have Kubuntu mostly idling on the CPU side, actually using less RAM these days. It didn't used to many, many years ago, but it's using about 100 megabytes less RAM. So you can see right there, 638 megabytes of RAM on boot up. So there is quite a difference with these two. Uh, like I say, Kubuntu was always the big uh, resource heavy desktop environment for the Ubuntu uh, system there, but uh, these days not so much. Uh, Ubuntu itself, uh, stock Ubuntu seems to take the lead in terms of how much RAM is used. It's all in the names of optimization, all in the name of optimization and what it can do, but uh, otherwise that's just a bit of a clear look at uh, what you're dealing with on boot up as a general guide. So thanks for watching guys, please leave a comment, subscribe, hit that like button, and I do hope to see you there in the next one. Cheers.